Okay, I'm going to show you guys how to remove browser redirect hijackers, uh, basically a browser that hijacks your browser and it keeps redire redirecting you to the same site. I'm going to show you on all three br uh, uh, browsers, Google Chrome, then IE, and then Mozilla Firefox. Okay, so the first thing you want to do before you jump into any browsers, you always want to go into the control panel and you want to do it add remove, go into add remove programs. Okay, so I'm going to go here, uninstall program. Now, here's the thing in here, guys. What you want to do is, like, for instance, if it's a, um, a if, if the hijacker is like a browse-search.com, you just want to come up here and you want to type in any word to do with, like, uh, search or any, any word that has to do with your browser uh, hijacker name. You can always type it up here. You know, like, like a lot of them, the name starts with search. You know, it could be, like, mysearch.com. Uh, conduitsearch.com, you know. So anything to do, what you do is you type in a, a lot of the, um, you know, um, it could be anything in here. So first thing to do is type in your browser hijack your name in here. If it's not in here, look for other words in here as well. And then what you want to do is look down this list, and anything in here that has a word like, um, it, it, I don't know, it could be uh, the word s save or. Um, or some, something to do with the word like tab, or it can be uh, something to do with the word toolbar. And, and you know, a lot of times they, um, what they'll do is um, it'll be difficult to find the actual hijacker because the name will be something ridiculous, or it can be the name of like the company, like an LLC, you know, creative, um, creative Joe dot LLC or something. So you have to be wary of that. You know, you really have to look, look in here and really try to find uh, the browser hijacker um, Okay, once we're done that, you want to go back up to this uh, this wrench and go all the way down to Internet Options, and then right here, make sure your home page is like changed on here. Then what you want to do <clears throat> is the last step. We want to go to um, click on Advanced, and we, we want to do a reset here. Now, don't forget a reset. You're going to lose all your favors. It's going to delete all your favors. Basically, it's going to make it a new Internet Explorer. Uh, once you go ahead and like reset. Uh, go ahead and close your IE, reopen, it should be gone. Now let's move to Mozilla Firefox. Okay, Mozilla Firefox. First thing you want to do is on the top left hand corner where that little Firefox symbol is, click on down here. You want to go, you want to go to add-ons. Here you go, under extensions. Anything in here that doesn't look, uh, that you think is related to the uh, browser hijacker, go ahead and disable it. Even if you don't know what it is, disable it. It doesn't matter, you don't need any extensions anyway. Next thing to do is you want to go down to plugins. Go into plugins. Anything here that's involved with your uh, your hijacker, even if you don't, if you're not sure what it is, go ahead and uh, never click on never deact or never activates. Okay. Next thing we want to do is we want to um, go back up here, click on the little Firefox symbol, and we want to go to options. From here, home page. Make sure the redirect is not in here. And the last thing we want to do is we want to do uh, a reset on the browser. What we do is let me open up a new tab here, and you see the uh, search bar here. You click on this little down arrow here, and we're going to go to manage search engines. No, I, actually, I'm sorry. We're going to do the. Uh, this is the second to last part. So go to manage search engines, and if you see your hijacker in here, you want to remove it. Now finally, the last, the last step, it is resetting. What you want to do for the resetting is uh, we can do this. So you go back up here to Firefox and we want to go to go to help. 
and then go to troubleshooting information and this is the page where we'll be able to reset if you look on here look on the right hand side it says reset Firefox here you go it's the last step once you reset follow the prompts here reset it close and uh, reopen Firefox and your problem should be solved any questions regarding these browser hijackers just comment below and any likes and subscriptions would be uh, great too thanks guys bye